Harbin, home to the world's largest ice and snow festival. Let's go take a look. Harbin is the capital city of Heilongjiang province in northeast China. Harbin Ice and Snow World opened in 1999 and is the largest ice and snow theme park globally. The theme of this year's event is the light of the Winter Olympic shines on the whole world. This installation is inspired by the Olympic torch. It is 42 meters tall and roughly the height of a 15-story building and constructed with 20,000 cubic meters of ice. It is a fitting tribute to the Beijing 2022 Winter Olympic Games. More than 200,000 cubic meters of ice have been used to build more than 100 ice and snow installations this year. It is a real winter wonderland with sculptures and installations that this year draw on classic architecture from countries that once hosted a Winter Olympics. This is my first time here and in Harbin and it's so amazing. I've never seen anything like this. You know, I, I, I called my mom when I was here and she was just amazed by this. It, how big it is and you know how much skill has to go into making this stuff. So cold though, but so worth it. Like, it's amazing. I don't have words to describe it. It's just, wow. These ice castles look amazing when illuminated at night. The LED lights make a real festive atmosphere. And you can even walk inside many of these buildings. But where does all this ice come from? Giant blocks of ice are taken from the nearby Songhua River. At 1.6 meters long, 0.8 meters wide, and either 40 or 50 centimeters thick, each block weighs hundreds of kilograms. These ice blocks are transported to the ice city, where cranes stack them several stories high, and over 2,000 craftspeople get to work transforming them with swords and chisels. The park opened in late December and will stay open until late February when temperatures rise and the ice melts. When the next winter comes, the process starts anew. Wow, right now the temperature is around minus 70 degrees Celsius, so no worries about melting just yet. Besides the ice sculptures, there's also a 423 meter long ice slide, which I'm excited to try. Harbin Ice and Snow World is just one of the attractions offered by the Harbin International Ice and Snow Festival. There are also opportunities to try out winter sports such as skiing and ice skating. This event has its roots in Harbin's first ice lighting fair in 1963. Over time, new activities were gradually introduced and the first ice and snow festival was held in 1985. With the Beijing Winter Olympics just around corner, the whole country's enthusiasm is heating up, and I, for one, hope the Games will be a big success. <laughs>